Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing great today. Today, we're finally back with another episode of Dragon Age Origins after I've been away during the week leading up to Halloween. So, we are picking up where we left off, which was in the middle of that wild zone, and I was following the trail of uh, signs that were visible for me on the map. I don't really know where it leads, but I intend to find out. And we also need to find the tower where um, we are supposedly going to find the last part of our initiation quest. So uh, let's see where that leads us. Let's get into it. Here we are. So, a couple of things from last time I was playing. I did not realize this, but apparently if one of your companions goes down during the fight, they get a penalty for, well, after they are revived. So, this... I'm assuming... Um, is it Jory that went down? I think it was. So, let's see. Let's see if we can find his current problem. What does this mean? Fatigue. Oh, oh, I see. Okay. That's kind of cool, actually. Okay. Oh, he's much more fatigued than we are. Wait. This is plus and this is minus. Oh, cracked skull. Penalty to cunning. Okay, well, I can't imagine he was very cunning to begin with. Oh, that's actually pretty significant. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Alrighty then. And this is what? Item said bonus. Nice. I got none of that. Oh, he does. That's good. And Davith. I'm the only one who doesn't, but that makes sense. Because I don't really have stuff on me. <laughs> okay, uh, I leveled up. So that's good. Now a level 4 mage. So... I want to put one into here. Should we just continue with this trend? Willpower, magic, cunning? Until we run into a problem? Is that fair? Let's see. So... We got heals. The caster channels regenerative energy to the selected ally, granting them a boost to mana stamina regeneration. That would not be a bad one to have. Glyph of Paralysis. Is it twice, then? Oh. Okay. This is a trap kind of situation. Spell Wisp. Spell Shield. Mana Drain? Walking Bomb, that's interesting. Mind Blast, that sounds familiar. The caster projects a wave of telekinetic force that stuns enemies caught in the sphere for three seconds and reducing that generated threat generated on all afflicted targets to zero. Okay. Or I can continue with Entropy. Vulnerability Hex, Disorient, Drain Life. The caster creates a sin sinister bond with the target, dealing 20 plus 0.2 times spirit? Spell power? Spirit damage to the target in order to heal the caster for the same amount. I am actually quite tempted to get this. Death magic. Draws in nearby entropic energy, draining residual life force from any dead enemy nearby. That's kind of cool. Curse of Mortality. The caster curses a target with the inevitability of true death for 20 seconds. Interesting. Death Cloud. Summons a cloud of leeching entropic energy. <clears throat> or, I guess we can't really continue to here because we don't have 25 magic. You know what? Let's do this. Let's do drain life. That sounds good to me. 
And I'm the only person who leveled up, I think. So, six. Let's put you elsewhere. Like maybe on 12, even. Alright, cool. <laughs> I like it. So that's just gonna stay on me, then? Arcane shield, bonus to defense. Alright, I'll take that. Now you can get to four, I think. I will um, make this a bit easier on myself as I go on. Okay, so we have this. So let's just continue following this trail. And no one corrected me on the chastened pronunciation, so I'm just going to take it at face value then. This is where I came from. This is where it wants me to go? Yeah. And that chest I could not open because I don't have the skill. Looky here. Looky here? <laughs> Alright, where's the next one? Do we have a next one? Oh, maybe not. Okay, well, it looks like I could go this way, or this way, or down here. So, let's check out the northwest first. Well, besides some elf root, I didn't really find anything here, and it looks like it's mostly a dead end, so I'm going to go to this area this time, and see where that takes me. <laughs> that took me to another elf root, so the only other direction that we can go is going to be south. So I will meet you guys there, full of elf roots. <laughs> Alright, so this is as far as we've been so far, I think, as of the previous video. So here we are again, and uh, let's see, let's see what we got going on here. Also, another thing that I wanted to do, that I kind of forgot last time. So I did not put any healing potions on their bars, and I really, really should. Don't know if they need anything else, really. A helmet. Okay. That's another thing that I should be paying much attention to. So I am quite outfitted, it looks like, but they... Are not really. You have the two-hander. Oh, that's right. And I needed to put you or give you something else. Actually. Warden's longsword. That'll do for you. And let's give you a shield to defense four. So that should be better for him. Because uh, <laughs> two-hander, it hits great, but he is not the most sturdy person. Let's see. Davith, what can you use? 0.67, 16 strength. Do you have 16 strength? I'm guessing you can use this because it's not grayed out. That would make sense. So let's give you this two-hander. Alistar, do you have a helmet? You do not have a helmet. Let's give you one. You look dopey now. That's okay. Alright. Well, let's move along. Also, I wish there was a way to drop these guys to the ground because this is... It's quite rude to just leave them hanging like this and move along. Okay, this looks like a trap. So, that's fun. More dark spawn. Close by. You know the drill. Okay. Dark spawn. I can't really even see you. Okay, let's get a little closer. Alright, now let's do our thing. So, 
Genlock Rogue, you can get hit. And you? Let's see. Shield Famo, Shield Bash, Shield Cover. Let's do this and then attack you. Well, I guess I can't really do twice. Okay. Now you... Let's see, what can you do? Stealth, dirty fighting, and hitting shot. Let's do that on you. There. Now you can attack him as well. But... Pommel strike? Mighty blow. Mighty blow sounds good. Okay. Good. Doing fine. Um, I think I saw another person. Um, can we do a pinning strike on you? Because you're a magic person, so you're probably going to be running away from me. And maybe I can paralyze you. Just for good measure. Jesus Christ! What the hell was that? Holy cow. Okay, let's eat this. And I can probably use one too. Alright, Alistair, why don't you attack this guy? You can also attack this guy. And I will also attack this guy. Alistair, you are not doing so well. Let's see, what else can we do? None of that, sadly. Maybe I can heal Alistair instead? Alistair, come here! No, this isn't good at all. I don't want him to die. At all. Good, we got him out. Alright, you guys need to finish him. And I need to paralyze this guy. Thank you. Oh shit! Jory! Jory is not good. Alright, we have two left. We got an archer. So you... Let's see. You are generally okay. Maybe let's do this on you. And let's see. Sunder arms. In the target's ability to fight back. That's good. Indomitable. Through sheer force of will, the character remains in control of the battlefield. Plus one damage. Immune to stun or knockdown. That's good. Mighty blow. Pommel strike. Let's pommel strike you. And I need mana. So let's take this. And then see if we can heal Jory. Poor 
jewelry. Oh, he went down again. God damn it. This is hard. Alright. Let's see. You are dead. So you get weakened. And you can attack this guy. And you... Well, let's do that. And maybe dirty fight him again. Okay. There's going to be a lot of... A lot of different... Um, control issues that I am running into. Come on, guys. You can do this. All right. Jory, I am so sorry. <laughs> you are not doing so good under my command. Now he has two things. Penalty to attack speed. How do I cure this? I think I need to um, rest, maybe? Or go back to town? But I just got here. Okay. We we will get through this. And we will get better eventually. But it might take a while. Alright. Excerpt from local myths and legends and pouch of ashes. Pinch of ashes, sorry. All right, so let's see. Um, there were more people. There we go. As you desire. Malachite. Okay. Where's the? Yeah, there it is. Okay. Now let's see. Uh, it should be in the codex somewhere, shouldn't it? About how to get rid of those wounds. Injuries! That's the one. Uh, one of your party members has fallen in combat. He or she has now sustained a serious injury. These injuries cause penalties that can only be cured with an injury kit. Or certain high-level spells. The injury is indicated by the small red icon that you can see above the quick bar when you have the injured character selected. Or in the character record. Okay, so I need an injury kit. And I haven't seen any yet. So just resting doesn't do anything. Because I, I guess there's no really rest in here. Oh! Oh shit! I didn't even see these! Okay, let's not walk in there. Lots and lots of people dead. Dark spawn staff. And I have a blackened heartwood. Okay. One spell power, fiery spirit damage. I don't know if this is better. Spell power two, spell power one. Eh? Maybe it is. Let's give it a try. Cool. Now, I don't see where the other chasing sign is. So it's probably in the unexplored area. So let's let's find it. Oh. Well, that's not suspicious at all. What do we have? Oh, chase and trail sign. More dark spawn close by. Really? You know the drill. I do. Are we about to get ambushed? Oh. That's right. Of course. Duh. You know what? You getting paralyzed. 
you guys are attacking him all. Jory, I'm so sorry. There's two of you. You know what? One of you can get weakened. Actually, maybe this guy instead. There's so many. That's ridiculous. something that's <laughs> not that great I promise I will get better at combat as I get more and more used to it chastened cash Ooh. as you desire is there another flower no that's the quest flower what ropes Helmet, bow, crusher. Okay, I'm gonna take it all. <laughs> Let's see. So, um, we got a helmet. Maybe Jory can use it. Three defense. You're welcome, Jory. Um, what about me? Chase and robes? Willpower, magic. Mm, not the best. More elf fruits and a weapon. Um, wait, Crusher, are you two-handed? You are. So maybe Jory can use it again. Minus five attack, melee, critical chance. Ooh. I don't know about that. Maybe not. Now, can you use a new bow? Nature resistance. Damage six, critical more. Armor penetration less and range less. Okay. I don't know about that either. So, that was probably what those trail signs was leading me towards. So let's go further. This seems like a natural progression. So I have to wonder if I could go this way instead. Death roots and pile of rocks. Okay, let's check it out. Of course. Of course indeed. You see a pile of stones covered in a fine layer of dust and ash. Sprinkle more ash on the pile of stones. Leave the stones alone. Um, uh, let's do that. Nothing happened. Oh! Gazarath? What are you? That's crazy. Gazarath. I guess. Shield pummel. Normal damage with each attack. Each attack gains plus 10. Let's do that on you. Wait, attack you first. And then do that. Now, again. Attack again. And fight dirty. Sunder arms. What is this? Whoa! Can I weaken you? And you can shield bash him, maybe? 
That's fine. Indomitable. And mighty blow on this guy. Don't say I didn't warn you. Resisted? Oh god. I bet I can't paralyze you either. All right, then. That's still on cooldown. I think we're fine, aren't we? Drain life out of you. Wow! You are on fire, sir. Chainmail. Who the hell is Gazarath? Medium armor, 16 strength. I think one of us can wear it. Maybe Jory again? Oh no, Alistair can do too. Oh, it's about actually exactly the same. Light armor. Jory, what do you do? 16 strength. Okay, that's all the same. That's a shame. So that's all like pile of rags? Oh. Two drops. Light boots, a six defense. Ooh. I don't really need a whole lot of it. Oh, only my, a mage can wear it. I, I mean, if you insist. <laughs> well, we sprinkled some ashes on things. I'm trying to scout out. Oh no. Something's happening. What is- oh, that's an enemy. Okay. So should I go back to the previous place? I turned off pause on combat because it was actually pausing on um, a visual of an enemy instead of combat, which was not very fun. So hopefully that goes okay. Um, I think I'm going to go this way just to make sure I'm not missing anything and it looks like I can see the edge of the map here so that should be fine I think I hope yeah because I can't get up there and this is it so let's find out what's going on yeah, that was the edge of the map. Okay. So I inadvertently went the right way anyway. Um, I wanted to check something else. I had an... Uh, was it an item? Quest related. So I did that. Rigby's will. Farewell. Letter. Pinch of ashes. So this is what I just did, right? One such mystery lies behind the tale of Astia and Nebunar, two young lovers who lived in Ostagar. The legend says that Astia grew up in the company of Gazarath, a spirit of the earth bound to an overhang on the bank of a lake in the Kokari wilds. Gazarath began to fancy her, and they spent much of their days together, talking and laughing. Over the years, however, Astia became a woman and began, began to seek the company of men. When Astia met Nebonar, the two fell in love, and Astia hoped to bring her lover to see her spirit friend. But the spirit, angered and jealous, bade her be gone. Gazarath told her that she would never see it again until she brought her lover's ashes and sprinkled them over the spot. Astia was horrified, and she fled from the enraged spirit, but she began to miss Gazarath, and one, on the day Nebonar asked her to marry him, 
she cut her beloved's throat, burned him, and brought his ashes to Gazarath. Knowing that their marriage would forever sever her ties to her dear spirit friend. There are legends among the chastened that Gazarath still haunts that lake, and that those who sprinkle the ashes of the diseased over the right spot can summon the spirit. In memory of the contract with its beloved Astia, Gazarath will grant a single wish and then vanish, never to be heard from again. A note is scribbled in the margin beneath the page. Marcus, I think this is real. If you take the ashes I gave you and scatter them over a pile of rocks on an overhang overlooking that half-sunken Tevinterdome, maybe Gazarath will appear and give you a wish if the battle takes you there. I think it's worth a try. Oh my god, holy shit. Um, you know what, you guys? I think I take it back on reading the, the codex in the video uh, because things like that are absolutely amazing. <laughs> okay, that explains a lot, but he never granted us any wishes, I guess. So only part of that story is real, unless I misunderstood, which is entirely possible. Okay, so we have our elf root and we have our enemy approaching. Oh, there's two of them. Well, probably more than two, honestly. You are already attacking. Okay, then. There's four of you. So. Actually, that's not good. So let's do this. Um, I suppose you can move in and attack. Same with you. Right away. Like that. So you can paralyze him. Paralyze. Well, all right. Good. Herlock. Alpha, I should have paralyzed you instead. So let's weaken you, perhaps. Alistar, you are fine. What are you doing? Are you down? Oh my gosh. Right. Alistair, please. Alright, I should be able to do something, right? Maybe help, help finish this guy off. Let's see, shield bash. That sounds reasonable. That's okay. You can mighty blow that guy. That is, does not do. <laughs> or will not do. As you wish. Okay, you are dead. That's good. So now you can fight this guy. I'm a little bummed that um, you can't move the screen more. Let's do that for you. Very nice. Very nice. Okay, good. Done. 
Yes, thank you for that health potion. Ooh, fire bolt, fire arrow. Can I give those to Davith? Where would I put it? I see. So, arrow. That's good. So, okay. So you have these special arrows. And uh, if you run out of those, I'm guessing you just use your default? The endless ones? That's kind of cool. I don't think... We killed the guy here, didn't we? Hmm. He must not have had anything on him. We have another death route. That's good. Oh my god. This is the cash. Okay. I really need to look into what alchemy actually does more. I should probably save before I do this. That is broken as hell. And very much empty. Sadly. Oh, who are you? Well, well. What have we here? Are you a vulture, I wonder? A scavenger, poking amidst a corpse whose bones were long since cleaned? Or merely an intruder, come into these dark spawn filled wilds of mine in search of easy prey? Of mine? What say you, hmm? Scavenger or intruder? Uh, no, I'm neither one of those. Where did you come from? Stay back. I would first know who you are and where you come from. Intruder. And just how are these your wilds? Oh my gosh, all of these are good answers. Um. Okay, two. <laughs> because I know them as only one who owns them could. Can you claim the same? No. I have watched your progress for some time. Where do they go, I wondered. Why are they here? And now you disturb ashes none have touched for so long. Why is that? Don't answer her. She looks chastened, and that means others may be nearby. Oh, you fear barbarians will swoop down upon you. Yes, swooping is bad. She's a witch of the wild, she is. She'll turn us into toads. Witch of the Wilds. Such idle fancies, those legends. Have you no minds of your own? You there. Women do not frighten like little boys. Tell me your name and I shall tell you mine. <laughs> she turned me into a newt! I got better. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right. Um, also, interesting line. Women do not frighten like little boys. That does something, uh, sound like something a witch would say. Forget it, you first. I am Lyra. A pleasure to meet you. Promise you won't harm us. You can call me Lyra. Hmm. Pleasure to meet you. I don't know, but might as well. Now that is a proper civil greeting, even here in the wilds. You may call me Morrigan. Morrigan! Shall I guess your purpose? You sought something in that chest? Something that is here no longer? Here no longer? You stole them, didn't you? You're some kind of sneaky witch thief. How very eloquent. How does one steal from dead men? Quite easily, it seems. Those documents are Grey Warden property, and I suggest you return them. I will not, for it was not I who removed them. Invoke a name that means nothing here any longer if you wish. I am not threatened. 
This is Morrigan. I have heard this name so often. I've never seen her, but apparently she is a spectacular character, so I am so excited to meet her. Okay, then who removed them? Also, the way <laughs> she is talking to Alistair is hilarious. She is treating him like a... <laughs> a petulant teenager, basically. Which I guess is not... Not too dissimilar from the way that he's acting right now, but still, this is so funny. Okay, she's toying with us. Let's go. Tell us at once or face the consequences, then who removed them? Well, why, why would you threaten consequences? Unless she's lying, I guess, which we wouldn't be able to know. Twas my mother, in fact. Oh, okay. Can you take us to her? Your mother? Is this a joke? <sighs> hmm. There is a sensible request. <laughs> I like you. I'd be careful. First it's, I like you. But then zap. Frog time. She'll put us all in the pot, she will. Just you watch. If the pot's warmer than this forest, it'd be a nice change. Follow me then, if it pleases you. If it pleases you. Hmm. If it pleases the light. Greetings, Mother. I bring before you four Grey Wardens who... I see them, girl. Hmm. Much as I expected. Are we supposed to believe you were expecting us? You are required to do nothing, least of all believe. Shut one's eyes tight or open one's arms wide. Either way, one's a fool. She's a witch, I tell you. We shouldn't be talking to her. Quiet, Dareth. If she's really a witch, do you want to make her mad? There is a smart lad. Sadly irrelevant to the larger scheme of things, but it is not I who decides. Believe what you will. And what of you? Does your elven mind give you a different viewpoint? What do you believe? This is fascinating. I believe you're crazy and possibly dangerous. I'm not sure what to believe. I'm no fool, if that's what you're asking. I believe you have something we need. I believe we have you have something we need. They did not come to listen to your wild tales, mother. True, they came for their treaties, yes? And before you begin barking, your precious seal wore off long ago. I have protected these. You... Oh, you protected them. And why not? Take them to your Grey Wardens and tell them this Blight's threat is greater than they realize. Wow, I did not expect her to be... Positive? Good? I don't... She doesn't give off the vibe that she's good, but... So Supportive, I think, is the word that I'm looking for. Thank you for returning them. What do you mean the threat is greater than they realize? How do you know all this? I'm sure they'll be eager to act on your advice. Okay, how do you know? Do I? Perhaps I am simply an old woman with a penchant for mold departments. <laughs> sure. Oh, do not mind me. <laughs> you have what you came for. Time for you to go, then. Do not be ridiculous, girl. These are your guests. Oh, very well. I will show you out of the woods. Follow me. Ah, what an interesting relationship uh, that they have. Oh! She just disappears? I guess... Oh wow, she just took us all the way to the camp. Oh wait, it's night time. Does that mean I can go and get that chest? Can I get past it? Is the puppy okay? Puppy is okay. Let's see. Did the tranquil dude le Ooh, he did. Oh my goodness. Ooh-wee! That's awesome! Mine! 
Thank you. <laughs> Alright, let's go heal the puppy. The Mabari stable for now, but not improving. Unless I get that herb I told you about, there's not much hope. Yes. Let me see. Yeah, that's exactly it. Wonderful. Yeah, give me a moment and I'll make this into an ointment. Do he I need to apply already. it? I'm sure he'd thank you himself if he could. Oh, okay. Good. How long before there's an improvement? What will happen to him now? I'd prefer thanks in the form of pavement. Hmm. Let's give him a day or two to recover. Why not come back after the battle? Perhaps we can see about imprinting him on you. I can get a puppy? Maybe. It's likely he understands you're responsible for curing him. Mabari are at least as smart as your average tax collector. Come back after the battle and just... Or take another look. Alright. Level up for Alistair. Let's level you up. Okay, so strength, dexterity, willpower. That's an interesting one. For warriors and rogues, willpower grants more stamina for combat techniques and special attacks. Ooh, that's good. Um, you do need more health though, sir. So maybe let's do that. And... Let's do willpower for you. I think that's fine. Stamina? No, let's go strength. I see. So, righteous strike is a passive. This one needs level 9. Oh, threaten. So this is going to turn him into a proper tank then. Pierce. Precise. Striking. I can't read today for some reason. The warrior tries to make each attack count, sacrificing minus 10 attack speed, or plus 10 attack as well as a formula. <laughs> Critical chance. For as long as this mode is active. That might be a good one for him, actually. Dual weapon, archery, two-handed. So shield bash is the one that I was using quite a bit, and he got into this stance here. Is this shield defense, weapon and shield. While this mode is active, the character drops into a defensive stance that favors the shield, granting plus 5 defense, plus 5 missile deflection, and suffering minus 5 attack. Okay, so this would be a tanky, a tanky one. I don't think I want to take him into the two-hander route. So... I want to try this, though. This is more attacky than defendy. Now let's make him let's make him tanky. I think this makes sense. As much as I would like for him to do more damage. Right. So we got the cash. I need to go to a different town for this. So the only thing, the only two things, are what we were sent off with. So let's go fix it. Finish it, I guess. So you returned from the wilds. Have you been successful? Somewhat. Not that it was easy, but yes. Good. I've had the Circle Mages preparing. With the blood you've retrieved, we can begin the joining immediately. I am ready. And what if we have second thoughts? Maybe we should tell you about Morrigan and her mother. Now, will you tell us what this ritual is about? I think he needs to know about Morrigan. Because it doesn't sound like he does. There was a woman at the tower and her mother had the scrolls. They were both very... odd. Were they wilder folk? I don't think so. They might be apostates. Mages hiding from the Chantry. 
I know you were once a Templar, Alistair, but Chantry business is not ours. We have the scrolls. Let us focus on the joining. He doesn't care. That's actually surprising. I would want to know about the woman who has kept my scrolls for however long. I will not lie. We Grey Wardens pay a heavy price to become what we are. Fate may decree that you pay your price now rather than later. I have no problem facing what is to come. Is that why the joining is so secret? You're saying the ritual can kill us? I've come this far. I want to see this through. I've come this far. I want to see this through, first of all. And second of all, it kind of sounds like... Um, or it doesn't sound like it, but it reminds me of the creation of a witcher, in a way. I agree. Let's have it done. Then let us begin. Alistair, take them to the old temple. Thank you, Alistair. The more I hear about this joining, the less I like it. Are you blubbering again? Why all these damn tests? Have I not earned my place? Maybe it's tradition. Maybe they're just trying to annoy you. Well, it's working on him. Calm down, there is nothing we can do about it now. I don't like this any more than you do. I swear, I'm the bravest one here and I'm a woman. Okay. Are all humans such cowards? <laughs> I don't like the last two. I don't like this any more than I do. Okay, no. Number one. I only know that my one. wife is in Hyover with a child on the way. If they had warned me, I... It just doesn't seem fair. Would you have come if they'd warned you? Maybe no. that's why they don't. The Wardens do what they must, right? Including sacrificing us? I'd sacrifice a lot more if I knew it would end the Blight. Look at you, Davith. Will you both shut up? <laughs> that's a horrible thing to say. But we don't know that, Davith. You make a good point. We do not know that. Don't we? The Grey Wardens have saved the world from Darkspawn before. I'd say they know better than anyone what it takes. You saw those Darkspawns tonight. Wouldn't you die to protect your pretty wife from them? I... Maybe you'll die. Maybe we'll all die. If nobody stops the Darkspawn, we'll die for sure. I've just never faced a foe I could not engage with my blade. At last, we come to the joining. The Grey Wardens were founded during the First Blight, when humanity stood on the verge of annihilation. So it was that the first Grey Wardens drank of Darkspawn blood and mastered their taint. We're going to drink the blood of those... those creatures. As the first Grey Wardens did before us, as we did before you. This is the source of our power and our victory. Those who survive the joining become immune to the taint. We can sense it in the Darkspawn and use it to slay the Archdemon. So that's why he could sense them. It is just like creating a Witcher, isn't it? And if we're not sure about this, those who survive, let's go on with it then. Okay, let's ask for clarification. Not all who drink the blood will survive, and those who do are forever changed. This is why the joining is a secret. It is the price we pay. We speak only a few words prior to the joining. But these words have been said since the first. Alistair, if you would. Join us, brothers and sisters. Join us in the shadows where we stand vigilant. Join us as we carry the duty that cannot be forsworn. And should you perish, know that your sacrifice will not be forgotten. And that one day, we shall join you. Davith, step forward. That's a cup. No hesitation, I respect that. I am 
sorry, Abbot. Step forward, Jory. But I have a wife, a child. There Had is I no known. Turning back. No. You ask too much. There is no glory in this. Jory? I am sorry. But the joining is not yet complete. You are called upon to submit yourself to the taint for the greater good. From this moment forth, you are a Grey Warden. Two more deaths. In my joining, only one of us died, but it was horrible. I'm glad at least one of you made it through. How do you feel? Oh my god. Okay. There is no turning back. Thing one. Thing two. I did not expect Davith to not make it. It seemed like he was made for the job. Oh my god. That was more painful than the harrowing. Nothing you said prepared me for that. I still can't believe you killed Sir Jory. It's over. I'm fine. Whew. Such is what it takes to be a Grey Warden. Did you have dreams? I had terrible dreams after my joining. Such dreams come when you begin to sense the dark spawn, as we all do. That and many other things can be explained in the months to come. Before I forget, there is one last part to your joining. We take some of that blood and put it in a pendant. Something to remind us of those who didn't make it this far. Take some time. When you're ready, I'd like you to accompany me to a meeting with the King. Wow. I still feel in shock. What kind of meeting? Very well. I very much feel in shock. Death is never easy to accept, especially when it arrives in such a brutal fashion. Honor your comrades if you wish, but know that we must press forward. Always we must press forward. The meeting is to the west, down the stairs. Please attend as soon as you're able. Ooh. New screenshot? Oh, I leveled up from that too. Wow. That's... that's crazy. My shield is still up. Oof. Yeah, we continue. We continue with that route. My goodness. Death magic. I do want that, I think. What about spirit? Mana drain? Oh. That could be an interesting path too. But I think I want this for now. Go full entropy. Did I not finish it? I thought I did. Sorry. Oh, I have another point. Okay, this is why I wasn't seeing. Never mind. Um, well, now that we have that, should we... Should we go for spirit? Spell shield? Dispel magic, anti-magic. Ward... First, Russian prison. Polykinetic weapons. That's cool. 
Huh. That sounds good to me. The second skill. Death Siphon. So let's try that. I don't know how effective I can be at the time bomb situation, especially considering that my only other potential partner here is Alistair, and I don't even know if I'm going to be traveling with him again. Since everyone else died. Okay. Oh, goody. Logain, my decision is final. I will stand by the Grey Wardens in this assault. You risk too much, Kaelin. A Darkspawn horde is too dangerous for you to be playing hero on the front lines. If that's the case, perhaps we should wait for the Orlesian forces to join us after all. I must repeat my protest to your fool notion that we need the Orlesians to defend ourselves. It is not a fool notion. Our arguments with the Orlesians are a thing of the past, and you will remember who is king. How fortunate Marek did not live to see his son ready to hand Ferelden over to those who enslaved us for a century. Then our current forces will have to suffice, won't they? Duncan, are your men ready for battle? They are, Your Majesty. And this is the recruit I met earlier on the road? I understand congratulations are in order. Sort of. But also condolences at the same time. Also, um... He- Loghain is correct. Why would you be at the front lines? You're the king. You're supposed to be the commander. Huh. Thank you, your majesty. I didn't have a choice, really. I don't feel that special. Well, thank you is fine. Every Grey Warden is needed now. You should be honored to join their ranks. Your fascination with glory and legends will be your undoing, Kaelin. We must attend to reality. Fine. Speak your strategy. The Grey Wardens and I draw the Darkspawn into charging our lines, and then? You will alert the tower to light the beacon, signaling my men to charge from To cover. flank the Darkspawn, I remember. This is the Tower of Ishal in the ruins, yes? Well, who shall light this beacon? I have a few men stationed there. It's not a dangerous task, but it is vital. Then we should send our best. Send Alistair and the new Grey Warden to make sure it's done. I'll do my best, Your Majesty. You mean I won't be fighting in the battle. I refuse to be sent on an errand. If it's not dangerous, I can do it myself. Ooh. Leaving Alistair with the rest of them? I don't know. I don't know if I can fight off any problems should they arise. You mean I won't be fighting in the battle? We need the beacon. Without it, Loghain's men won't know when to charge. You see? Glory for everyone. You rely on these Grey Wardens too much. Is that truly wise? Enough of your conspiracy theories, Loghain. Grey Wardens battle the Blight no matter where they're from. Your Majesty, you should consider the possibility of the Arch Demon appearing. There have been no signs of any dragons in the wilds. Isn't that what your men are here for, Duncan? I... Yes, Your Majesty. Your Majesty, the tower and its beacon are unnecessary. The we Circle of Magi- We will not trust any lives to your spells, mage. Save them for the Darkspawn. Enough! This plan will suffice. The Grey Wardens will light the beacon. Thank you, Logain. I cannot wait for that glorious moment. The Grey Wardens battle beside the King of Ferelden to stem the tide of evil. Yes, Kaelin. A glorious moment for us all. He is shifty, isn't you he? You heard the plan. You and Alistair will go to the Tower of Ishal and ensure the beacon is lit. What? I won't be in the battle. This is by the King's personal request, Alistair. If the beacon is not lit, Terran Loghain's men won't know when to charge. So he needs two Grey Wardens standing up there holding the torch, just in case, right? Hmm. Stop your whining. We have an important job. I agree with Alistair. We should be in the battle. Where is this Tower of Ishal exactly? I'm ready to go. Yeah, where is it? The tower is on the other side of the gorge from the King's camp, the way we came when we arrived. 
You'll okay. need to cross the gorge and head through the gate and up to the tower entrance. From the top, you'll overlook the entire valley. Sounds good. Where will you be? When do we light the beacon? Sounds easy enough. Yeah, where? I'm assuming he's going to be at the front lines with the king, right? I will be fighting beside the king with the rest of yeah. the Grey Wardens. Again, at his request. We will signal you when the time is right. Alistair will know what to look for. Of course. He knows everything, it seems. Are we in any danger? How much time do we have? What if the Archdemon appears? Can we join the battle afterwards? I know what I have to do. I'm assuming we can join the battle. Stay right? with the Terran's men and guard the tower. If you are needed, we will send word. Okay, that's fine. What if the demon appears? We soil our drawers, that's what. If it does, leave it to us. I want no heroics from either of you. Fair enough. How much time do we have? The battle is about to begin. Once I leave, move quickly. You'll have less than an hour. Okay, fair enough. Then I must join the others. From here, you two are on your own. Remember, you are both Grey Wardens. I expect you to be worthy of that title. Duncan. May the Maker watch over you. May he watch over us all. This is very ominous. So I need to head over to the bridge. Kennels. Uh, so I need to talk to the puppy after. Should I? Should I try to talk to Logan? He was this way, wasn't he? Oh, I can't. Okay, so to the bridge, I guess. Is it, is it this way? Tower of Ishal. Yeah, okay. This is it. We're doing it. Oh. That is not what I did. Of course it will. The blight ends here.
Let's cross the bridge Ooh. and get to the tower of his ship. Okay. You will fall. Let's run. Wardens, aren't you? The tower, it's been taken. What are you talking about, man? Taken how? The Darkspawn came up through the lower chambers. They're everywhere. Most of our men are dead. Then we have to get to the beacon and light it ourselves. That was the plan. Oh, they're with us. Okay. Um. So, what have they got? Anything? They're fully outfitted. That's good. I can probably use a healing potion too. Am I not? Oh, I can't. Okay, good. Now we're guarded as soldier. Alright. Let's figure it out. Let's do this one. Go and attack him. Shield bash. And I can try to par paralyze. Ooh, that's not good. Let's see. Um so he is paralyzed. And I can probably time bomb you. Guys, I need to change their settings or Alistair's settings. Ooh, did it? Did it actually hit him? He is paralyzed still. draws in nearby entropic energy draining residual life force okay and it'll heal the caster that's fine <laughs> alistair don't die i cannot paralyze you i don't think anymore well for a while anyway <laughs> Alistair, protect me. Let's see. Let's be on the defensive. Quickly shot. You can attack him. And so can you. Running away? What a doofus. Away with you! Alistair. Seriously, my guy. Do. 
okay. Alistair, please. Yes? I need to be a healer just for Alistair. And so I shall. Whew. All right, all right. We can do this. My god, that is a lot of people. Her okay. So I can paralyze one. No. Paralyze you. You hit him. And same. And same. Of course. Now I can hit you too. Good. So you can get actually. You can get bombed. And all of you attack him. Good. Oh, Alright, so I don't think it attacks us when he blows up, which is good. Unless I'm totally misreading the situation. Okay, good. We are fine for now. Good. Very good. We survived another one. Now I just need to wait for my mana. Okay. So if maybe I can paralyze you. Can I not see you? Oh, that's weird. Alistair, go here. You go here. You go here. Yes. I guess I really can't see him. Can't I do this? Paralyze. Have some glory. Okay, good. Alistair, continue. And I shall also continue. This is goofy. Oh my goodness. Alistair, please. Survive. Okay. I think we are fine. Pummel him. Okay. 
interrupted. Berserk! Oh, that's crazy! Okay. We are alive. That's good. That pathing was awful, by the way. While she was on the stairs, you know? Oof. Just a little bit to go. Chest! I did not see you. Oh. Damn it. Wait. Archer. Do you do this? Can you do this? Tower guard. No. No. Both of you are warriors. That makes sense. Here we go. We're doing it. How many things do I need to fight in there, I wonder? Are we already at the top? Tower of Ishal. Damn. Okay, what can I do here? Herlock. I need to get to them. Okay, let's see. I can try to deal with you. You can attack you. So let's do that. Yes. It's a fight. How lovely. Everyone is slow. Oh yes. That's no good at all. Okay. So, let's see. I can probably time bomb you. Alistair, can you go? Please. Nice. Okay, so now go to the Herlock. And I can try... I don't really need this, but I kind of want to try it. another one of these. Where are you going? Okay, let's see. We have two archers. So you can go attack him. You can... You finished him already. That's good. As you desire. I need to heal you. Oh my god. It's a fight. How lovely. Why did you stop attacking him? I 
I should be able to heal you if I had the mana for it. Okay. So now, Alistair, please. I should be able to... to kill you. Or to help kill you, anyway. Oh my goodness. Okay, that was intense. But we survived. Let's fix it. Fix the battle hilt. Battle hilt? Battle field is what I meant to say. Thank you for the Healy. That is quite appropriate. Same as Delirium Potion, really. Thank you for that. Love no, you are locked! God damn it! What is this? Second floor? Where we need to go? Ooh, okay. I can go to many places. Does that mean that there's going to be enemies in there? Oh god, of course. There's so many! Oh my god. That is no good. Okay. So I can do this to you. You guys can attack him. I can help you. Oh, good. I need to change his tactics. Oh my God. There's a guy behind. There's so many. Alistair, do this, do that, do this, and I, I can time bomb. Yeah. They just keep coming. That is insanity. Oh, good God. I need to heal you again. Who do we have? Tower guard? Let's go in here and attack this Hurlock. Tower guard, please. Let's just focus, guys. Tower guard, come in here. Oh, is that? All right. Let's do heal on you. Alistair, you're doing good. holding for the moment 
As you desire. Okay. Ooh, we loot, loot everything we can. Every chest is locked. It is awful. Okay, I take it back. Not every chest is locked. Oh, good god. Hopefully all of them just... ran from all the adjacent rooms. Okay. As you desire. Oh god. All right. All right, all right. Now, I can do my favorite thing. Paralysis on you, and you attack, and you also attack. attack. Whew. We are okay. For now. in this state for a bit. Everything is locked again. Okay, so I could have gone to this place. Now, should I have? I don't know. I, maybe. Let's check it out. Ow, oh, that's just where I came from. Never mind. I was mistaken. Let's go back. This is quite... Intense, actually. Well, all right. Well, all right, it is. What are these darkspawn doing ahead of the rest of the horde? There wasn't supposed to be any resistance here. That's true. You could try telling them they're in the wrong place. There's no point moaning about it. We have fighting to do. Why attack the tower at all, unless they know the plan? Aren't you complaining that you wouldn't get to fight? Yeah, that's a good point, actually. Now that's a scary thought. They couldn't know about the plan. How? They're not that smart, are they? Someone anyway, else could be. We need to hurry. We need to get up to the top of the tower and light the signal fire in time. Taren Loghain will be waiting for the signal. Um... Do we have any enemies ahead of us? Probably. chest and a wooden crate is what we have here. And lots of dead people. Chest is locked, I'm guessing. Yep. Checks out. Ooh. Ballista? <gasps> oh, I want to try that. I will kill myself. All right, all right, all right. Let's not die yet. I got one of them. That was nice. And time bomb the Herlock. I 
guess it didn't make it, huh? Okay, this is actually not terrible. Yes. And this guy's just standing there? Would I go and use the ballista again? What? Oh no! I... That was dumb. I was friendly firing. Okay, you guys, go and fight. I promise not to ballista you. Off I go. Okay. I can paralyze you. You are attacking who I want you to. That's good. You need help? Time bombed you, but I can't. Because I don't have mana. That's okay. Are you serious? My goodness. Okay. Ballistas were very nice. And so I shall. Is there anything else for me to find? A chest? That is locked? Is it? Yep. Of course it is. Discarded book! Of course. Chantry. Ooh. I they better not have more enemies. No, thank you. Injury kit! Yes! Thank you. I did not see you guys at all. Okay. Right, moving forward. To this door here. Probably another set of enemies, too. Yep. Let's lure them out, actually. Alistair, come here. You, come here. Soldier, attack him. I can do this on you. Yeah. Can I close this door? I want to try. <clears throat> nice! I'll take that. They're just in front of it now? Yeah, let's... let's recharge a bit. I'll take it. Alright, 
fine. Yes. Let's have at it. good I can't believe the door trick worked that's crazy wow we do work okay together for now as you desire lovely thank you for the heals by the way course every locked chest you know what next playthrough it's going to be a rogue also holy shit they totally knew what was happening there's no way someone tipped them off they had to Logain better be ready to charge as soon as we light the signal. The king is depending on us. Whew, I don't have a good feeling about all of this. Okay. Are you enemies? I can't tell. You gotta be. Yeah, you are. Alistair, here. Good sir, here. All right. There we go. Let's be smart about this. Uh, can I paralyze you? What? Let's attack this now. How's that? So far, so good. Attack. Don't run away! Oh my god! What now? Oh, it was you, wasn't it? Who needed to go places instead of staying behind? Okay, we are okay for now. Lovely. Alright, so positioning is important. Doors actually work. And trying to funnel them through the doorway is a decent strategy, is what we are learning here. Well, all right. And a longsword. <laughs> okay, let's go back to this idea then. So, Alistair. Come back. You, sir, come back. All of you, come back. As you wish. And you can get paralyzed. So you can fight him with the rest of you. I'm good. Cut them down! Alistair? Be nice. He's rallying. 
Okay, so, you. Um. Shattering shot? Crippling shot. Let's cripple you. Let's do it. Very well. Oh, that's the alpha. Okay. So if he is the alpha, he can get weakened. Not good. Who are you attacking? Not him. Away with you. Alistair is leveled up. just in the doorway. Okay. Alright, let's see. Let's... Woofer? Woofer! We got a dog. We, we... I hope we can have a dog. That would be awesome. Okay, you are level 6. That's good. You can use more health for sure. Let's actually give you even more health. Now, what do you do here? Highly experienced in combat and ga gains small bonuses to armor and attack. That sounds good to me, actually. Ooh, got another one. Threaten. Ah. Uh. Improved combat training. Do I have that? The character has learned to compensate for the weight of a shield in combat and no longer suffers an attack penalty while using shield defense. Um, yes. Let's go for it. Puppy. Puppy. Quiet. Of course it's locked. Can I open this? Woofers. Help me. Yes! Let's go! Why is there so many doors? Go even further so the woofers get engaged. Yeah. Now I let's paralyze a herlock. <laughs> now attack this one. <laughs> Do that to you. Ooh. Oh, man, 
This is working quite nicely. And they all came out. Of course. Oh. I wonder if the woofers can just follow me. Can't they? Or do they need to see an enemy first to go anywhere? I am unsure. So they all came out of here. And there's another injury kit, thankfully. Puppies, come with me. I guess they don't come. That's a shame. Oh, they came out of here too. That's good. I kind of appreciate that the game um, alerts everyone as soon as one of the groups get alerted. It's kind of realistic that way, I think. Are we in danger? Oh, yes, we are. Okay. So. Let's do this. You. Um. Move freely. Yeah, you go back to the woofers. Same with you. And you. Are we in a hurry? And I will lure the people, I think. If I can get to my character. There we go. Perfect. So now the woofers are a little further and we can start attacking. Yes. Now let's maybe paralyze one of you. The dogs are just going ham. That's amazing. Well, all right. You are still attacking him, huh? Okay. So let's go back to our full party selection. I think we could have looted this guy. We probably should have. That's all right. Um, did we clear it out? I think we may have. Um, let's go loot. Puppies, I really appreciate your help. And so I shall. And thank you so much for it. I wish you would just follow me. it's locked <laughs> of course are we almost at the roof I hope top floor no more puppies for me That's 
fun. Who are you? Ogre? Okay, I thought he was a demon. Not that it's better. Weaken. You can shield bash him. Or try to. That's fine. Oh, you can taunt. I did not realize that. Um. Why don't you try to shield bash him as well? What? Well, I'll I don't want I don't want to be here. <laughs> Pummel. That's fine. Cripple you maybe. You can pummel him too. Alright. Good god. Okay. Oh my god! Jesus Christ. He really does not like me. I guess that's not surprising. Nerd. Oh goody. You know what? Can you actually switch to your second weapon? And just... just do that instead? This is awful. <laughs> All right, I need mana and stat. Oh god. He is not going to live through this. Oh, he's dead. Oh my god. Oh my god. Can I weaken you, maybe? Oh, no. Don't kill Alistair. He's such a good guy. Oh my god! Oh, he's not gonna live. Did we see that attack? That was awesome! Holy the cow! Here. We've surely missed the sick. Holy cow! Let's light it quickly before it's too late. Okay. That's the beacon. And that's the barrel. I That was awesome. <laughs> That was totally awesome. Okay, let's light it. Hello. 
least all of you let's move happen Oh ah your eyes finally open mother shall be pleased Hello you're finally awake Where am I Back in the wilds of course I am Morrigan, lest you have forgotten, and no. I have just bandaged your wounds. You are welcome, by the way. Thank you. How does your memory fare? Do you remember Mother's rescue? No. Mother managed to save you and your friend, though it was a close call. What is important is that you both live. The man who was to respond to your signal quit the field. The Darkspawn won your battle. Those he abandoned were massacred. Your friend, he is not taking it well. No wonder. Yeah, is it Alistair? Because it's definitely not Duncan. <sighs> All dead. Your friend has veered between denial and grief since Mother told him. He is outside by the fire. Mother asked to see you when you awoke. Wow. Why does your mother want to see me? Where were my injuries severe? <laughs> yes! You are pierced, looking like a hedgehog over there. I have some questions if you don't mind. Thank you for helping me, Morrigan. I do not mind. Take your time. Are there any survivors besides us? How oh, did she manage to rescue us exactly? That's a good question, isn't it? She turned into a giant bird and plucked the two of you from atop the tower, one in each talon. If you do not believe that tale, then I suggest you ask Mother yourself. She may even tell you. I am half convinced she's not joking. Why did your mother save us? Are we safe here? Huh. I wonder at that myself. But she tells me nothing. Perhaps you were the only ones she could reach. I would have rescued your king. A king would be worth a much higher ransom than you. <laughs> ransom, huh? Okay. Hmm. 
Coin is important too. That's a good question too. Who says I would ransom for coin? Gold has its uses, I suppose, but power buys far more. Okay. Any survivors besides us? Only stragglers that are long gone. You would not want to see what is happening in that valley now. So why did Logain abandon the king? I do not know who this Logain even is. Perhaps ask mother of it. Yeah, she wouldn't know. Are we safe here? Where are the darkspawn? We are safe for the moment. Mother's magic keeps the darkspawn away. Once you leave, tis uncertain what will happen. The Horde has moved on, so you might avoid it. That's crazy. I agree. Tis time you speak with Mother, then be on your way. That is insane. Well, guys, I am going to leave this here. Um, this was quite an unexpected turn of events, not gonna lie. Um, I did not... I mean... Loghain did not really have an aura of a good guy to begin with, but I did not expect that he would do this. I thought he was loyal to the king. Where did that come from? I would be much curious to have a conversation with the guy if that's ever a possibility in the game. So, yeah. I feel really sad about Duncan. Because he seems like a very stellar guy. And for him to die because of that sleazeball's betrayal is really unfair. So, I'm not really sure what else to say. But I do have to say that Morgan and her mother are very mysterious and extremely interesting characters to me. So I'm curious to find out how their arc develops. I can't imagine we're not going to be um, seeing them continuously throughout the game, so I am excited to find that out. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and uh, if you did, please consider leaving me a like and subscribing, and I will see you in the next one. We'll see how this all shakes out. Bye for now. <laughs>